so we're on Little Pine Creek right now. We're above Little Pine Lake and above Little Pine State Park. And uh, there's an absolute ton of people up here today. We've seen six to 10 people in some of the larger holes per hole. So what we've done is we've come upstream and we found an area that they don't really stock uh, like they do the lower section. And we're trying to put some chartreuse garlic salmon eggs in there, see if we can get bit. Got him, first cast. It's my kind of fishing, first cast. Not a bad looking rainbow. Can you get him up here? Yeah, I'll swing him up. Oh, yeah, there he is. Whew. There he is. Right in the middle of the hole, too. Nice rainbow. Nice rainbow. Looks like he has some good color. Oh, that's a better that's a better fish. Good yeah. colors. Oh yeah. oh yeah. Yeah, look at the colors in that guy. Another rainbow that same run. Is it a better one? No. Oh, it is a nice one. That well, that's a nice one, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Get him out of that current, yeah. Oh. Woo! Picked up another nice rainbow in that drift right there. I mean, they're hitting that just about every cast. Not a bad little guy. Nice rainbow. Oh yeah, it's a better one. He's holding right in that turn. Check out that guy there. It's one of our better fish from this part of the creek. I mean, real dark rainbow, first drift. Nailed it. Down. There he is. Seems just about every cast in this hole. I'm getting tired of watching this guy catch fish. This is a better one. Feeling some drag air. Fatty. There he goes. It's not a bad one. Yeah. That's fish number nine in less than 30 minutes. Moved to the first hole, caught our five. Second hole, that's number nine. We're gonna see if we can get a bobber down on number 10. This is getting to be, this is getting to be ridiculous. First drift, orange shrimp fireball. Getting to be ridiculous. Good colors too. Better fish. Oh, that's a good one too. Nice rainbow. Yeah, Ooh, that's not bad fish at all. Uh -huh. Another bobber down. That's a good one. Just another bobber down. Good. Another one. See if we can get a double. That's a different color than that guy. All right, so we have now got 14 fish in about an hour or so. 
Isaac's gonna go for number 15. That means his 15th fish that he's caught and released, folks, not kept. We don't keep fish. So, looks like gold garlic fireball is gonna be the lucky one. We're gonna see if we can get this in here. Remember, we've already caught a bunch of fish out of this hole, so this hole has been picked over all day. And we're hopefully gonna get number 15 right here. That might not be a, yeah, it is a rainbow. It's just got a different color to it. It might be the smallest rainbow. We've yeah. Today. You, my friend, are the smallest rainbow we've caught today. But you have nice color. So we'll throw you back. Today's episode of Potsky Outdoors comes to you from kind of halfway between Lock Haven and Williamsport, Pennsylvania. We're on Little Pine Creek, but the section above the lake. Uh, if you can distinguish by the fish and game stock reports exactly where they stock and where they don't. This place right here is stocked for several miles above the lake. Now, the action came today on Boy. It seems like it's becoming Pennsylvania's favorite natural deluxe salmon eggs. Boy, they're probably the hottest egg in the state right now. But as soon as we caught a couple of limits on those, we switched over, grabbed a bunch on chartreuse garlic salmon eggs, and then we switched over to gold garlic fireballs, caught a bunch on those as well. Caught and released every fish today, so they're still swimming for you. One of the things you want to consider when you come up here, okay, light line, light tackle is the way to go. By that I mean two or four pound test, small BB split shots, and yes, we did use a float today. Reason being, keep your bait from getting stuck on the bottom. If you can get it to roam freely and drift a few inches off the bottom, they're gonna smack it every time. Looks like we're gonna have to try number 15 again. 